We just received an update on Spectrum from Xylo pertaining to ship claims, and we're just going to go straight into it. Xylo says, I wanted to update you on the progress of the team's effort to improve the experience in Alpha 3.18. We have been diligently implementing hotfixes to address the most pressing issue and while we have seen great improvements, there is still more work to be done. One issue that has been negatively impacting our database is the large number of entitlement calls being made for player vehicles as initial startup. To alleviate this, we are implementing a solution that we hope will significantly reduce the strain on the back end and help us provide a smoother service. Our intention is to roll out this solution out soon, but we wanted to give you an earlier heads up of the incoming change to how you summon your vehicle. The change will make it will affect how you obtain your vehicle when logging into the game for the first time. Instead of being immediately entitled to your home location in game, ship purchases on our website will now be available at any ASAP terminal labeled as deliverable. You can claim your ship by pressing the deliver button, which functions similar to standard issuance claim, but is free and only takes about 20 seconds. We believe this subtle change will make a positive impact on the database, resulting in a lighter startup and overall improved stability. We will continue to closely monitor and work additional solutions to further improve the service. Thank you for your patience and support. We look forward to seeing you in the verse. So that is essentially it. What they're essentially doing is they want to reduce the strain on the servers. For me personally, I have a, a few ships, not as many as others, but I do have a few ships. And even me, I own a Carrick and I haven't spawned my Carrick in the game yet since 318 went live. So what's the point of loading that into my entitlement if I'm logging in for the first time? People are initially going to use their early game ships and won't require their end game ships that they own already. So for them doing this, I don't see any impact at all from our side personally but um, if this will help improve things in terms of launches of the next patch or the 4.0 build i'm absolutely happy with that you guys let me know your thoughts on this down below also a new 3.18 build just dropped into the live servers so make sure to check it out i'll see you on the next video